This is a South American poison frog, but it's barely poisonous, if at all, and not as colorful as its more familiar cousins. What's intriguing is how it cares for its tadpoles. The female lays the eggs in the forest, and when the embryos are reaching tadpole stage, the male takes them on his back and carries them to a rainforest pool where they can finish growing into frogs. To learn more about this behavior, scientists went to the rainforest in French Guiana. They had tarps, Wi-Fi, and it was a French research station. We get frozen food delivered, but we'll include like five types of cheese as well, so you feel that, that you're in France, even in the middle of the jungle. First, they had to catch the frogs. No easy task. Then, they outfitted each frog with a tiny transponder on a silicone waistband. They used a paintbrush to gently load the tadpoles on each frog's back. As the frog disappeared into the vegetation, they tracked it using a handheld device that bounced radio waves off the transponder on the frog's belt. All the frogs they tested, male and female, carried the eggs directly to a pool, sometimes as far away as 200 yards. For an inch-long frog, that's a day's journey or so. What really surprised the scientists was how simple it was to trigger this complex behavior. Tadpoles on the back, off goes the frog. They would even carry tadpoles from a different frog. Pretty puzzling, but the study of amphibian behavior is still in its infancy, and no doubt there will be a lot more research. Fortunately, whether we understand it or not, it works for the tadpoles.